and welcome to Theme Park Worldwide where it's time for the final vlog from my June 2022 trip here to Antalya in Turkey. I've had a fantastic time and if you haven't already make sure you check out the playlist here on the channel featuring all of the videos from this awesome trip. I'm ending it tonight then here for my first ever visit to Akhtar Park. I really don't know what to expect apart from they've got a huge Ferris wheel here, there's a few different roller coasters <laughs> and quite a lot of other big thrill rides. However, walking down here just, I can't see lots of rides in operation. I've seen a couple of rides going round and obviously the big wheels in operation, but I'm not too sure about everything else. So I don't think I'm gonna get all three coaster credits. You never know, a miracle might happen. But let's head inside and go and check out this park. Now, as you can see, the park has got a very impressive entrance. It's a huge castle. And yeah, I do like the signage on the front just there as well. You know, the prices for all the rides just down there, it seems pretty reasonable. And yeah, I have just seen the pirate ship in operation too. Now, of course, I'm gonna be riding on the heart of Antalya, which is the massive wheel over there. However, I don't think you actually get to it through the entrance here. I think it's got its own entrance just off the car park there. So before I head in through this gate, I'm gonna head over to the wheel because I don't wanna go through here first and then find out that, uh, yeah, I've gotta come back out and go around to the big wheel. Here we go then. So we've got a few rides starting up now. I've just seen the twister coaster going round. The booster has got some people on as well. And over here, we've got some ride action as well. So yeah, I think we're gonna be all right. It's advertised as open through until midnight. So yeah, I should be able to get a good few rides in down here. And here it is, the heart of Antalya. The huge Ferris wheel. Yeah, it's massive, this is. Can't wait to give this a go. It's nearly 300 foot tall. The original plan was to actually go on here for sunset. But yeah, as you can see, the weather hasn't been the best these past few hours. It was actually raining earlier on. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping that it's gonna stay dry whilst I have a ride here on this giant wheel. Well, the wheel stands at 90 meters and weighs 400 tons. I do love a good big wheel and I can't believe how cheap it is, 40 lira to ride. Yeah, that's like two pounds. That's crazy, that is really cheap. And yeah, look at the pods going around the outside just here, the gondolas. Oh, I've got a magic carpet over there. One of my all time favorites, oh, I love those. But yeah, here's my card just here, I've been over to the booth. So I actually had to pay 45, because you pay five lira, which is hardly anything, just for the card. And then you must top that up to use the other rides here at the park as well. Yeah, we're gonna head through this turnstile. I think we'll just scan it over here. Let's go on. Hey, 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 my gondola awaits. Here he is. Hey, how you doing? Oh, hey, hey, high five. Lovely. Oh, look at this. Oh, thank you. Oh, I get this all to myself. Oh, look at this. The seating. Oh, wow. Table in the middle. Screen up there. And it's beautifully air conditioned as well. Yeah, the weather might not be playing ball tonight, but you know what? Yeah, I'm not complaining. Like, I've got this all to myself. And yeah, you should still get some nice views of the mountains. Oh, the sky's going a bit black over there. Fingers crossed it stays dry, at least for my ride on here, just so it doesn't mess up the windows. I've got a little bit of time where I could have done it tomorrow, but the weather's not looking good for tomorrow either. So I thought, well, you know what? It's dry right now. I was going to risk it, come on here. And so, yeah, we're going to get some great views over the park. All the rides do seem to be in action, or at least most of them anyway. It looks to me like they're just opening up. And from when I looked online, it said the park opened up in the afternoon through until midnight. So I think so that the park's just getting going, you know. There's um, a lot of people just pulling up onto the car park. So I think I've timed it quite well. I'll tell you what, this view is impressive already. It'd be even nicer if the sun was shining. But yeah, you can see all the mountains over there in the distance. Yeah, everything seems to be open now. Little drop tower. There's an octopus down there. I tell you what, it's dirt cheap, so I'll be doing loads of rides. Oh, there we go, shark trips open just down there. And also the caterpillar off to the right, yeah, so the three coasters on the database are all in action, which is good. So yeah, I'll definitely give all those a go, and a few flats as well. Love a good booster. Yeah, there's quite a bit down here, so fingers crossed, as long as the park stays open, then we'll go for it. You got a Rapids, that's open off to the right. Go-karts over there as well. And yeah, this wheel is lovely. Can you see King Kong down there? Let me zoom in on him. There you go, you just see him next to the roller coaster. Now I might not be getting a shark trip down the road. However, that's the exact same model just over there. So I'm not complaining. <laughs> yeah, great view over the park. Now, if you want to see the hotel that I'm staying in, check out the previous vlog to this one. 
So give you a little room tour. And I tell you what, the view is incredible. I'm staying kind of at the end of that, what looks like a peninsula from here, but I don't think it actually is. Um, yeah, right over there in the distance. I've actually walked all the way down here. If you were doing it all the way, it'd probably take you about 90 minutes, but I had a little stop off on the way. But yeah, it's really nice around here. Nice just taking it all in. Having a bit of an explore around. You've got loads of hotels. The beach looks great as well. As much as this is the last vlog here on Theme Park Worldwide, over on Adventure Sean, there's going to be some bonus content from the trip. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, it's a nice little park, this is. I say little, it's a bit bigger than I was expecting. And you get a great perspective. Like I said, I wanted to come on this in the daytime to see the mountains. And it's not quite as impressive as I was hoping because of the clouds. But you know what? You can still see them and that's the main thing. It looks like a model village from up here, doesn't it? Especially looking down on another tall ride, such as the booster down there. <laughs> yeah, it's a really cool view. I'm still shocked at just how cheap this is, to be honest. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, it's like £2.50 to come and ride. It's crazy. And getting your own private gondola. It's got all the seating round as well. Like, you couldn't wish for anything better. Like, it's fantastic. It really is. Great value. The best value big wheel I've ever been on. Well, it took about 15 minutes to get here, and we've now reached the top of the huge wheel here in Antalya. What a great view. And it gets even better value for money, this does. I didn't even notice this at first. I thought it was like an emergency button. It's a little Bluetooth speaker. So yeah, you can connect. And then of course, yeah, you can also plug in your device there on top. Brilliant. Like how cool is that? It's having a bit of a party in here as well. Like, oh! <laughs> you can actually feel it wobbling. Because I'm in here on my own. Like, look, you walk side to side in the gondola. <laughs> oh, right at the top. I think it might have just started to rain. Look at this water coming down here. It's not too bad though. At least we've got till this point. I don't mind going on the rides here in the rain as long as they're open. Because it's still really warm out there. Obviously coming on a wheel, you don't really want it raining. I always say this about the London Eye back home. Because, uh, yeah, you know, you're going to get water dripping down. Luckily, I've got to the top now and seen the epic views. Yeah, I'd imagine on a clear day, it's even better up here with the mountains. But still, I'm just happy it's open. And that I've got to come up here and experience it. We are putting a little bit more footage, making my way down, and then yeah, it's time to go and hit up the park. Three coasters down there, get on the spinner I think first, and then yeah, do some flat rides as well. Don't think there's any dark rides here, like a ghost train or anything. Can't see any, but you never know. That's always the beauty of coming somewhere for the first time. What a great wheel. Gradually approaching the halfway down point now. Yeah, just thought I'd show you a look there into the middle of the wheel. They always fascinate me, these wheels. Ever since I was a kid, of course, when the London Eye opens, I remember riding it and just being fascinated with it, you know, and since then I've always loved these giant wheels. They are great. But yeah, you can't get better BFM than this one, can you? Fantastic. Yeah, I'm looking forward to getting on some rides down here. We've got a really nice selection by the looks of it. Everything looks like it's going, which is good. And yeah, the park's getting busier. There's cars keep piling onto the car park. So I'm gonna head down and uh, yeah, go and check it out. Well, my ride here on the heart of Antalya, Big Wheel, is coming to an end. But it's been fantastic, I've really enjoyed it. It's about a 25 minute ride, I'd say, to do a full rotation. Amazing value for money. All the seats around as well, which is good. And yeah, the views are fantastic. They would be spectacular views, you know, if the weather was better. And you can see that with the mountains in the distance. Uh, but yeah, I've really enjoyed it. Absolutely brilliant. Would definitely recommend if you come in here. And I imagine at night it's really good as well, seeing um, all the park lit up and all the buildings as well. But obviously then you wouldn't get to see the mountain so yeah I'll probably go on in the daytime or at sunset like I tried to do um, tonight but so uh, yeah unfortunately the weather wasn't playing ball for that one how many times have I just walked around that table uh, but yeah anyway I'm gonna head down top up the card and let's go and get some rides here's a look then at the ride prices as you can see it is really cheap to go on the rides here Bear in mind, 100 Turkish Lira works out at just under five pounds. A lot of the rides are like 10, so it's crazy. Like, it's really cheap. It's got a really nice evening atmosphere in here. Yeah, security check when you come in. Pirate ship off to the right, and yeah, I'm gonna start off. I've put uh, 50 Lira on, so it's probably gonna get me about five rides. I thought I don't wanna top it up too much 
just in case the really bad weather comes in and they end up closing or something. But uh, yeah, anyway, we're gonna start off on the twister coaster just here. Got the chest mounted GoPro, I'm sure we'll be all right filming on right here. So let's go and have a go. And here we go then, first coaster. And yeah, I'm looking forward to this. This was 20 lira to ride. It's a really cheap, a couple of quid. And this is the biggest coaster they've got. So yeah, the others are gonna be cheaper, probably 10. Up we go. I think it's actually a member of staff that's come and join me on for the ride. I, th I couldn't quite understand it, but I think he said that you can't go on on your own. And then the member of staff just jumped on, so here he is. <laughs> the good news is I've just seen a ghost train. So yeah, I'm looking forward to getting on that. And to be honest, weather's clearing up a bit now. Right next to the main road, if you're coming down here and do want to get a taxi, just be careful. <laughs> oh, look at that view. Should I try and talk to him? What, there's the ghost train, look at that. What do you think? Woo! You okay? Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Yeah, that ghost train looks awesome. Definitely give that a ride. It's like a little shopping avenue opposite as well. Oh! Hey! Oh! <laughs> oh, bench trimming. Woo! Oh! All right, let's get ready for the spins again. Is the release going to be in the same place right here? And so it has. Whoa, not that much. You should have come and sat next to me. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, not the best spin, unfortunately. Oh, we've got some retro park hands here in the middle. For any that likes the uh, disco lighting, theater equipment. Woo. There they are, look, retro. <laughs> Fantastic. 20 lira well spent that was. Oh, shot brakes. Thank you. <laughs> Probably one of the most awkward rides I've ever had there, but you know what? He sat there smiling. I think he was okay. Uh, anyway, yeah, nice ride there to start off. I'm going to head down and do the other couple of coasters now, just in case the weather does take a turn. But to be honest, it's looking all right now. That ghost train is really drawing me in there. Well, that's perfect ride if it does rain, but I'll definitely be giving that a go. So I'm looking forward to it. Stay tuned for that. Park's got a great atmosphere. It's getting busier now. Oh, magic carpet over there as well. There's some great flats here. With how cheap it is, why not make the most of it? Looks like it moves a bit more than quantum at Thorpe Park. Looking forward to that. These are good fun. <laughs> I've done a few of these now out there. These are quite nice rides. They got one now at uh, Wicksteed Park back in the UK. We've got Shark Trip just over here. And then we've got the Caterpillar just behind it. Tornado looks good over there as well. The operator looks a bit bored just sat here. I was hoping he was going to have a bit of a queue to be honest. Just so I could kind of hop on. But no, he's going to have to send it just for me. Shark Trip, here it is. And there's the shark. The one down the road's closed a couple of miles away, but this one's open. So, hey, I'm coming on. Yeah, yeah, let's have a, let's have a go. Let's have a ride with Ariel. 10 credits. Morning, guys. Thank you. <laughs> what a lovely man. It was just like, YouTube, free, free. I'll let you on. So there you go. Didn't even have to use 10 credits. What a nice guy. <laughs> That's the time of the channel. Woo. It was like, YouTube, free, free. Hey, shark trip. There he is. Hey. Oh, what a nice guy, legend. Beautiful view there of the wheel. Woo! Hey! <laughs> Second lap. That's the back of King Kong. King Kong's bum. Just what you all tune into YouTube to see that, into the backside of King Kong. It's a weird little contraption that. Woo! Question is, are we gonna get a third lap? Oh my God, there's a break dance over there. What? <laughs> I told you it was a bit of a surprise, this one. We go again. Hey! I think it's one of these where they come up and then roll back to break. They don't really have brakes in the actual station. Woo! Getting a queue now. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh. I can't believe they got a break dance. I cannot wait to get on that. It's got loads of lighting as well. Woo! Is that it? So 
going down. Oh, brilliant. Good fun, that. 10 credits, but a free ride for YouTube. Not complaining about that. Right, let's go and get that third and final one. Then we can do some flats. That guy on there, so friendly. What a lovely operator. Having a great chat to him. And yeah, I've told him about the channel. So if you're watching it, hi out there to you and thanks for the free ride. Anyway, I'm going on the Caterpillar now. So yeah, I'm going to go and scan my card this time and have a go on here. Third and final credit. Then we'll head straight over to that breakdance because I love those. I have done so many of these now over the years. But you know what? A cred is a cred. My final roller coaster in Turkey of the trip. And yeah, I'm sure I'll be back at some point in the future. There is some other parks in Turkey to see further up north that I'd like to come back for in the future. So watch this space. I'll just try to avoid getting a taxi. <laughs> After that experience, it really put me off. All right, let's go on. And off we go. It's a back row ride on the final coaster of the trip. Oh, what a trip it's been. Honestly, I've really enjoyed it. Oh, that lift still made a funny noise then, didn't it? Actually uses kicker wheels instead of a chain as well on this one. One little fact for you. I think we're going to get a nice view at the top just here, actually. All the lights are coming on now. You got inversion just over there. <laughs> inversion loop zone. That's a view for you. Lovely. King Kong. <laughs> That's a weird ride, that. It's a bit like that King Kong ride at Bobby Ann Land in Belgium. But yeah, it's a different ride. But obviously, you know, it's also a King Kong structure. And there is the big apple. I like it when a big apple's actually got a big apple. It's got two. Here we go. Woo! Oh, it's actually got another name, this one. I've only just seen it over there at the back. Bro Brucomilia? Does that mean apple, does it, in Turkish? I don't know. Woo! But yeah, I wasn't expecting all three, especially when I've walked up on the outside. But literally, the part was just getting going, that's all. I was early, if anything. Fantastic, but uh, yeah, enjoy this last coaster ride. Then we're going to get some flats in because there's a great selection here at this park in Antalya. It's definitely worth coming down here though if you are visiting. Oh, all the lights come on now. Beautiful. But yeah, I think we're going to give that breakdown to go. The lighting package looks awesome. So yeah, let's go and uh, give that a ride. Hands up in the air. Come on, let's go. Woo! <laughs> oh, brilliant. Don't you just love the evening atmosphere during golden hour at an amusement park? The sun setting, all the lights coming on, the rides. Beautiful, it really is. Fantastic selection of flats here, including this. It's King Kong himself. There he is. I've never seen one like this before. Like I said, I've seen the one at Bobby Amland but not uh, this ride system. It literally spins round, and then King Kong's head moves side to side as well. How cool is that? I'll definitely jump on there and give that a go. That's only 10 credits to ride. They're mostly smaller rides, we're only 10 credits. But first, gotta get on this breakdown, stand out over here. Look at this absolute beauty. And yeah, it's got loads of lighting inside. And also on the top there, these ones aren't in action yet. Maybe they might be later on. Yeah, you got all them moving heads on the top. You got the crowd blinders up there as well. All this for just 20 credits. Like, it's crazy how cheap it is here. I love it. Oh, I cannot wait to get on this. So come and join me with a nice on ride POV from this break dance just here. It's crazy dance at Actor Park. Beautifully decorated, loads of lighting. This would be great at Winter Wonderland, wouldn't it? Pack it up and bring it to London. That'd be great. Yeah, it really is the full package, this one. Look at that. Here we go, then we're all loaded up. 20 Turkish Lira to ride. And yeah, I'm enjoying the music on here. All the lighting. You got some old retro lighting at the back there. And you got some modern lights around the side. So many moving heads up the top just here as well. They're not on though, unfortunately. Along with that, you got a ball machine, strobe lights, fog machine up there. The full package. Quite a bit of it's not on, but I reckon that's because it's really quiet down here. Seems like one of the least popular rides here, which is really weird. Oh, it's very smooth, I know that. Look at this beauty. Here's a little bit of off-ride footage of it in action. Oh, what a great park. Again, this place really exceeds expectations. And if you come in here as a Brit, it's crazy how cheap it is. Woo! Oh yeah, 
Yes! Woo! We got some clapping going on over there. Here we go. It's Turkey. Woo! Crazy dance. Let's go. Woo! 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 They're loving it in that car. <laughs> you know what we're missing though? Some sound effects. I like scream if you want to go faster. You know, all the classics. But you know what? This is great. Really nice. It's not too intense. But it's very smooth. Well looked after this beauty. Fantastic. Woo! It's actually got a mirror ball there in the middle as well. And mirrors all around the side, which is very cool. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a smoke machine coming on then. I was getting excited. That's what we need, a nice bit of smoke around here now. Woo! I love how they just clap it along, getting in the mood. Whoa, speed up a little bit there. <laughs> yeah, it's not massively intense at all, this one. But it's a nice overall package. I feel like they're not running it on full belt, the ride. But yeah, that was good though, about a three minute cycle. Could always have another go for 20 lira. Ooh. Oh, that was fantastic. And yeah, they've got all the lights on just out the front here now as well. That's the thing, it really attracts people over to it. And talking about lighting, the wheel is now lit up as well. Look at that. That is beautiful, isn't it? I'm not too sure about the function. I think these lights on the left are broken because the rest of it is changing colour. That's just staying red. But right, I'm going to top up now and get some more tokens. Like crazy. Absolutely crazy. I love it here. I love how cheap it is. I know I keep going on about it, but that is a massive plus point. Like, it is ridiculous, isn't it? But yeah, I'm going to top up. I've only spent 50 lira just there. And like I say, 100 lira, that's just under five pounds. So yeah, like absolutely ridiculous. All right, let's get on some more rides. Right, that's it, car's all topped up and we're going on Super Tornado now, this big gyro swing. So yeah, let's go and see how this rides. The atmosphere of this place has really just picked up this past half hour or so. Fantastic, it always does with these amusement parks, but I really wasn't expecting it to be this good. Like all the light here, the music's pumping out. It's amazing, it's a really good amusement park. Kind of like a permanent fun fair. Some of the rides though are park models. Like this one here, it's not a traveling model. You can tell when you look at the foundations, they're on concrete instead of on a trailer. Woo! This was 20 to ride. Woo! They really need to sort the lighting out on that wheel though. It is bugging me a bit. Still looks pretty though. And look at the park. Woo! Very tight over the shoulder restraint on this. Digs into your legs a little bit. Is it just me or do the supports look a bit like a candy cane? If you look at them, there you go. <laughs> Woo! Ready for the drop, it's coming. Not on the ride, I mean the music. Now, hey! Woo! <laughs> Fantastic. Woo! What a view. Woo! Oh yes. We've got the Rio Rapids just over there as well. <laughs> Go cards. Woo! Woo! Great ride. Woo! Got some good force to it as well. Woo! Well, that was good fun. Not the most forceful one that I've been on. But it was well worth going on there. And yeah, this part now, come alive, it really has. Great lighting everywhere, all the rides. Now, I don't know if it's a case of the rides are owned by a different showmen, and they've kind of all come together on this uh, kind of card token-based system. I'm not too sure, it feels that way, because each ride, you know, it's really trying to draw you in with the lighting. Look at this beauty, the camera doesn't do it justice. The old flying carpet here, oh, I cannot wait for this. Magic carpet, I cannot wait. Love these. Beautifully presented. Loads of LEDs on the sides. Look at the theming at the side there as well. This is lovely. Right, let's go and have a ride on here. This is 15 to ride. That's a beautiful view, isn't it, with all that lighting. <laughs> 
long time I'm on my own out here, but I'm not. There is another lady who sat just opposite. <laughs> Woo! Oh, what a view. Oh, he's got more force than Quantum already. Doesn't take much though, does it? <laughs> quantum used to be good, it's just very old now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Brilliant. What a lighting package. Whoa! <laughs> i tell you what, the bars are really heavy on here though. Whoa! <laughs> you can tell it's an older one. Woo! Oh! Sometimes the older ones are the best though. <laughs> Whoa! Woo! Brilliant. Oh, hold up the top now. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Fantastic. A view of McDonald's over there, the Golden Arch. Have one of those whilst I was walking up, nice and cheap as well. Whoa. That's the saying of this vlog, isn't it, cheap? <laughs> Woo! I don't know who this is sat just here behind me. You alright? Is it Charlotte? I don't know. Charlotte, you alright? What are you doing here? Ooh. I don't think it is Charlotte. <laughs> That was good fun. Whoa. 15 lira to ride. Whoa. Ah. <laughs> We're going again now. Oh, 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 Merry Christmas in the middle of June. Why is Father Christmas out? I don't know, but uh, it's all part of the fun, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, you got this drop tower just there, which is quite funny. Because you look at it and think, oh, it's huge. Actually, it doesn't go all the way up because, uh, as you can see, there's just some lighting on that top section that spirals round. But yeah, I'm going to head down to that ghost train now. Don't worry, I've not forgotten about it. You've got plenty of booths around where you can top up your cards as well, which is good. Down the steps just here on the ghost train is round to the right. So many rides still to do. Going to give that octopus to go afterwards. Love a good octopus. Hey, theme park worldwide on YouTube. <laughs> was that the guy from earlier? No, I don't think it was. Oh, look at that octopus. Beautiful. Rides are so well presented here. Right, let's go on the ghost train. Looks good this dude. I think it's a permanent one inside that show building. Now this has got the potential to be absolutely fantastic. Look at the facade on this. You've got this huge demon out there with his arms wide open to welcome me in. Or is he looking into his crystal ball? Or is it a brain? I'm not too sure. Here we go. This looks like it's going to be fantastic. Let's hope it rides as good as it looks because the facade is pretty epic. 15 to ride. Let's go. And here we go on the ghost train. Question is, is it going to rival the one that I did over in Vienna at Vienna Prater? Anything's possible. Uh, <laughs> that was actually really scary for me because I don't like dogs. <laughs> It's atmospheric, I give them that. Not more dogs. There were some cobwebs just hanging from the ceiling. Nice view looking out over the front. That's the first ride I've seen closed, the little balloons ride there. I think there was another one around the corner though, maybe that's why. Yeah, it's pretty decent so far. Not one of the best I've done, but certainly not one of the worst. There's some bad ghost trains out there, isn't there? Whoa! Again, you can't really see loads on the camera, but it's pretty good. I love it when you can see the work in. It's long. This corner, I've just seen it. There's a vortex trouble tunnel. There. Hey! Oh, it's a good long ride. 
going three minutes in now. See, even this place can get it working, and the one on Jules still broke. Well, you know what? That did not disappoint. That was good fun, that was. <laughs> there you go, that's the ghost train. Really enjoyable. Oh, lap bar up. Good long ride, very atmospheric, lots of effects. Can't go wrong, yeah, it was enjoyable that was. Wasn't expecting the vortex to leave us. Yeah, that was a nice surprise. Right, I'm going on the octopus just around the corner next. Choo choo, we even got a train ride running around just here as well. Loads of rides down here for the kids, family attractions. Got on that booster shortly as well. Well yeah, let's go and have a ride on the octopus. How unique was that little carousel ride just as well with the motorbikes, them lifting up. Not seen one like that before. What a view, wow. Here we go then on the octopus. Woo, fantastic. Bringing back them good old Kermis vibes. Can't wait to get back to the Netherlands at some point. Do the Kermis out there. Oh, great fun that was. Whee. Love it. Got the tunes pumping out. I'm not too sure what it is, but I'm not complaining. Great Atmos. Then we'll have a go on that booster next just there. Woo! Fantastic lighting package on here as well. Look at that beauty. And great operations on here as well. Getting it sent. That's how these rides make money though. If they're sat there for ages, people don't see them in action. They don't know what they do. People like to see rides going round. Obviously, you know, I like to think I'm a bit of an expert with it, but your general public coming to the parks, they don't really know what the ride does. So it's great for the showman. So keep sending them round, show people what it does. Hey, strobe lights. And then, yeah, it gets people excited and they're more willing to part with the cash. Turkish rave, Whee! <laughs> fantastic here on the octopus. And yeah, I'm pretty sure I've just seen in the distance that the breakdance is using all the lights now. So yeah, I'll probably have another go on there. May as well make the most of it. Woo! Fantastic. Woo! I like how you got the sharks round at the side there as well. The sharks must get on with the octopus, so we're all right. There they are. <laughs> Woo! Great fun. Right, I will see you now over on the booster. Looking forward to this, one of my all-time favorite amusement park attractions. So let's go and have a ride on there. It's gonna be good. Wow, that was fantastic. What a great cycle on there. Just really enjoyed the octopus. And yeah, here we go. It's ready for riders. No queue at all. Let's go and get on the booster just here. One of my favourite things about these boosters is just holding here at the top whilst they're loading the other side. You get awesome views, especially when you're in somewhere like this with all the lighting. Spectacular. Mountains have all disappeared now for the night. <laughs> yeah, it's a lovely view. And to be honest, I'm thinking with how cheap the big wheel was, I might have another go on there, actually. And that might be the perfect way to kind of wrap up my trip here to Antalya, just going on there. Oh, this is lovely, it really is. And again, it was a bargain, 20 Turkish Lira. Yeah, as soon as we're loaded up down the bottom, we'll be in action. Oh, here we go. So pleased all these rides have been open. Literally, I just got here and the park was, you know, just getting going for the day. I was worried thinking it was all short. No need to be. It's a fantastic park, would definitely recommend. Here we go. Woo! Oh, he's a thrill seeker next to me as well. He's got his hands up. Woo! <laughs> Great ride, just the scale of these that I love. Woo! Whee! Woo! Woo! We've got some screamers on the other side. <laughs> Beautiful. Woo! <laughs> He's doing some sort of dance next to me. He's literally loving life. Woo! <laughs> ah. Woo! It's quite 
funny, you can see McDonald's if you look close, so you can just see the golden arch upside down. <laughs> Ready? There. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Oh, yes. Great cycle as well. Woo! Hey! Not the most intense one that I've been on, but it's very smooth. Very enjoyable. Oh. There's a massive giant statue here as well. You see it when we come down. Oh! Woo! That's better. There he is, big giant. Oh, beautiful. We're going to get another one of them holes. I quite enjoyed that. That's it, end of the cycle. Absolutely brilliant that was, loved it. And the guy next to me, I think he enjoyed it even more than I did. Maybe that was his first booster, I don't know. Oh, uh, here's a little look then at Captain Barbosa just over here, the pirate ship, beautifully themed. We're gonna have to go on there and give it a go. And there's another look at the park entrance all lit up down there. Tunes are pumping out, vibes are awesome. Even the bins are themed here, look. Fantastic amusement park. All right, let's go and see Captain Barbosa. Oh, there he is, he's on top. <laughs> Well, the tunes are pumping on here. We've got some ride bangers on. Fantastic. 15 lira to ride. There's some nice piece of theming on here as well. Barbosa. Yeah, I like, oh, that's it, lights off. That's cool. They put on a good show on a lot of these rides. Little things like that. Instead of leaving the big floodlights on, just turn it off so you can enjoy the atmosphere. Even better. Love it when showmen do things like that. Whee! I'm on the back, so we might get a bit of air time. Fantastic. Oh, what a shoe! Turkey 2022. Woo! I do hope you've enjoyed following me on this adventure. Woo! Yeah! Let me feel that drop. Well, that was absolutely fantastic. Really enjoyed that. Great theming. And yeah, the lights kept being flashed on and off as well, which is always good fun. Anyway, I'm going to head down there now. How are we going in version? Right then, here we go. Shoes are pumping. Woo! Look at all the lights. Oh, hey. Some of the music that I've heard this show. We've got a right mix. Woo! I think these are a bit scared next to me here. Oh no, she's not, arms in the air. <laughs> Last couple of rides now at this awesome park. Woo! Oh yeah, all the way over. Nearly. <laughs> Woo! Hang time. Woo! Oh, epic. That's how I like it. Arms in the air, that's it. Woo! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> woo! 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 Whoa! Woo! 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 Got the strobes going. Woo! I've got to do some moves now, that's it. Straight your nose, big fish, little fish. Big fish, little fish. Cardboard box, I don't think she knows. Oh! I just felt some rain. Oh, talk about timing, if so. Woo! Awesome. Really good ride on there. Not the longest of cycles, but just a nice amount. Absolutely brilliant night I've had down here. I'm going to put in some more footage now, just showing you some of the rides at night with the lovely lighting. And then there's one more ride that I've just got to go on that I showed you earlier on. Really cool, look at the heart there on the wheel. Oh, I love that, that's an awesome effect. I know some of the lights are broke on there, but that still shows up really nice. We had to start to show you the go-karts that they've got down here as well. 
Yeah. Nice big go-kart attraction. Well, I think this is just shut now because of the weather. Because here we go, it is raining here in Turkey. Yeah, that's closed. So yeah, I reckon I need to get on this last ride now. I was, like say, gonna probably end on the wheel, but don't think there's much point now it's raining because I think all the glass is just gonna be covered in all the raindrops. I mean, I couldn't come to this park and not give this a go, could I? The one and only King Kong himself. Waiting for riders, let's go and get on. Money well spent. Well, I tell you what, this is gonna be the highlight of the trip. Never mind Hypercoaster at the Land of Legends. Look at all this. It's got this massive over the shoulder kind of comfort collar, like what you get on a Premier Ride Skyrocket. Seatbelts galore around here, but it still wobbles about. But I'm riding with King Kong. Here we go, on my own, in the pouring rain here in Turkey on King Kong. I think quite a few of the rides look like they're starting to close now. So yeah, I'm glad that I got everything in. Talk about perfect timing. There he is, main man himself, King Kong. Oh, what a part this is. I've really enjoyed it here tonight. I've been here like three hours, got loads of rides in. I'm actually here still tomorrow doing some other stuff for Adventure Sean. I might even nip in and do some more rides tomorrow. Uh, oh, it's absolutely brilliant. Great value. Come on, Kong, give us a spin. Kong, Kong, Kong. Oh, it's actually better than Kong at Universal Islands of Adventure. Doesn't take much though, does it? Oh, brilliant. King Kong, everybody. What a way to wrap up the final vlog from this trip here on theme park worldwide on youtube oh i love it <laughs> oh god well my ride there on king kong was awesome and i've also just had another epic ride here on crazy dance i've just filmed a nice 4k rider cam pov now the full lighting's in action for you strobe lights the lot and that will be coming as a separate video here on the channel very soon what a way to wrap up this awesome trip Well, I'll tell you what, the rain is really coming down now. I am absolutely soaked. But you know what? I've had a brilliant night. I've really enjoyed it here. What a park and what a way to wrap up this trip here to Turkey. This place is amazing. Get yourself to Aktor Park if you're coming here to Antalya. Or of course, if you go into the land of legends, uh, come down here. It's only about half an hour away. And come and enjoy this park. It's got so much on offer. And if you're a Brit coming over here, uh, or even from a lot of other countries, to be honest, you're going to find it really cheap coming here. Loads of rides that you can get in. It has been absolutely fantastic. It really has. And dripping wet through. Uh, I feel like I've been on the rapids in there. Uh, but no, great value park, nice selection of rides. I'd love to see them get a big standout coaster at some point, a big thrill coaster uh, would be great here. Uh, but you know what, they've got the wheel and that's the main uh, kind of thing what draws people into this park. But I was blown away with everything. The ghost train was fantastic, uh, the three junior coasters, uh, things like the magic carpet, the pirate ship, operations, prices, spot on. It's been amazing. What a way to wrap up the trip. I'm getting soaked outside this park in Turkey, but it has been absolutely wonderful. Thank you so much if you've watched every single vlog from this trip, or even if you've only joined me for a few of them. I really do appreciate your support. Thank you so much. And uh, yes, if you haven't already, check out the playlist featuring all of the different videos from this epic trip to Turkey. What have we got coming up on Theme Park Worldwide? Of course, check out our video we posted a couple of weeks ago detailing all the trips we've got coming up. Uh, we're going to be heading out to Denmark and Sweden soon for our Scandinavia summer trip. Hopefully better weather than it is now here. Uh, and along with that, I'll be going to Disneyland Paris for the anniversary celebrations as well. But uh, there we go, from Actor Park, that leaves me with one final thing to say. Get out there and keep on riding. See you all back in the UK.